during the summer months, they'll go all the way up uh, to, it's not uncommon, to South Carolina or North Carolina. Mm -hmm. We actually have had them go as far north as, um, as Cape Cod, but then they return to Florida um, during the winter time, kind of like snowbirds. And the same is true over on the West Coast is that um, manatees from Crystal River commonly uh, go all the way out to Mobile, Alabama, where we've been working with folks there uh, to tag manatees at the Dolphin, uh, Dolphin Island Research Lab. Uh, but they'll go out to Louisiana and Mississippi, and then again, when it turns cold or starts turning cooler, then they'll come back to seek refuge either in natural warm water spots like springs, like Crystal River, uh, or in artificial sources of warm water um, like power plants. Sometimes they get short-stopped. Um, that uh, they'll go into a power plant uh, further north on the east coast mm -hmm. and as temperatures drop it's not going to stay warm enough for them during the winter we actually have to go up you know with lots of partners um, to essentially rescue them and then bring them back to florida um, where we'll either put them out near a source of warm water if they're in good condition or they may um, have to go into a uh, um, what's called a critical care facility uh, where they're, you know, nursed back to help before they're uh, released again. And we joke around because there's been a couple of these animals that have had to be rescued, uh, you know, in multiple years. And we're going, well, they're pretty smart. They just get an Uber ride back home. And <laughs> <laughs>